All right, we finally got this six foot gate put in in the main paddock, the original one where uh, Pee Wee's at, and this opens up in the Coke's paddock. So we set the post yesterday and uh, got them concreted in. We hung the gate today, and instead of doing a jumper across here, and Heath's walking down through the piglet pens, and they think he's got food, so you'll hear that in the background. <laughs> So instead of doing a, a, just a couple jumper wires across here like this, we decided we would take an old uh, extension cord. And what I did on this jumper here, and this is just kind of rudimentary right now, is I took, and I'm not going to touch it because it's maxed out. I just tested it and it's maxed out. So what I did was I stripped the wire down, cut it, and uh, stripped it and rolled it around or uh, twisted it around there and got everything on. So we've got power from here. This will go underground here and over to here. And we just brought the three strands into one here and then ran it off of that. And that way we can swing the gate, leave the gate open, the, cable, the cord will be buried. And you know we don't have to worry about coming down here all the time and unhooking the, the jumper and everything like that so it's buried. Now I'll secure that cord to the post on both sides and then we can just leave the gate wide open and let coke and uh peewee mingle um and you know just try kind of in in between the paddocks and once i get peewee down in here because he's got all of this they've got all of these woods up through here down through there and clear down about halfway down the road there and that gets peewee out of this paddock up here and lets him get down in here and like i said get a make buddy buddy with coke for now all right so original pin like i said we did uh three wires we've since just went down to two on the other paddocks so the posts are in place the gates swung open we're just going to leave it open we're going to cover this up and that way now peewee and coke can intermingle and come in through and then we can close the gate as we need to without having to worry about a jumper unhooking a jumper and you know possibly losing power on up to the main paddock here so it's in now we're going to go do the one across the road for Boris's pen, where we got a jumper across there, and that way I don't have to keep uh, getting off the tractor, or off the UTV, and unhooking the the jumper, and crossing over, and then hooking the jumper back again. So good day to be working. Thank you, Heath. <laughs> <laughs> so we're in the woods today, buddy. We're getting her done. That's what we need to be doing. We've gotten a lot done in the last couple days, and and man. I tell you, man, you, you can't you can't even express the amount of appreciation you got for somebody who's going to come and help you like that. So you got a little bit of a vested interest in this, anyways, because uh -huh, you got because you got bacon coming. I got bacon coming. <laughs> so that's why it helps, man. Can't beat that. All right, guys, get stay prepared, stay free. God bless y'all.